Hello everyone, welcome back. I was doing this video three days ago and I went in to edit it that night and uh, my camera had shut off, you'll see the clip, uh, when I got to the middle of this egg. And um, all this will be explained when you watch the clip. But um, it was like, okay, I need to go ahead and refilm this. And the problem was there was one egg right here that was a double yoker from my uh, Americana Oricana mix chickens and I've waited three days to get another double yoker and I realized that it could be months. So anyway, I'm gonna, I'll show you this clip. I get through the, the mallard, the muscovy, the turkey, halfway through um, my tulu goose right here and then the, my camera just shut off for some reason. Hello everyone and welcome back. I had a request, I don't know, it's been a couple, two, three weeks ago to kind of crack open some of these eggs and see the difference. I think mainly they wanted to know the difference between store-bought chickens or like the white chicken and the brown chicken egg and stuff like that. So I thought I'm going to do it where we're going to crack all of them open and I will just make some scrambled eggs. So what we have here is a mallard duck egg. This is a Muscovy duck egg. This is a bourbon red turkey egg. This is a Tulu. So now that I've rewashed another batch of the same eggs, this is the Tulu Ghee Goose. That's the kind that I have out there right now. This is the Chinese White right here, which is uh, one that I picked up when I got the pigs. This one here is my Americana Oricana Chicken. This is my New Hampshire Red. And this is a store-bought white chicken egg. Over here we have the Cortunix Quail. We have the Georgia Giant Bob White Quail. And this is just a regular Bob White Quail. All right, so we'll start out with the mallard egg. They have a really hard, like, inner skin. There we have a mallard. Next we'll do the Muscovy egg. These are really weird because it's almost like they have a wax coating on them, different from any other egg I've ever seen. It's almost like they're, like I said, like they're dipped in wax or something. This one here is the bourbon red turkey. They too have a thick inner skin, really thick. It's hard to open these. There we go. Next we have the Americana Oricana chicken egg. I had to start writing what these were on there because I'll forget by the time this is done. So this one here is my New Hampshire. This one here now is the store-bought chicken egg. This one here now is the double yoker which is an Americana Oricana cross. Yep, and it was two. This here now is the Toulouse Goose. Oh man, that's a hard shell. So far I haven't had to double any of these because the yolk has not broke. That's a tough one. Well, that's a big egg. <laughs> so this one now is the Chinese white. This is the biggest one of all of them. Another hard shell. Not quite as bad as that Tudu goose, but close. <laughs> Look at the size of that. Feed a family of four. <laughs> Alright, now for the quail. This is the Corturnix. These are usually a pain to open too. They're just so small. Corturnix there. This is the Georgia Giant. Bob White. Oh, come on. There. 
And this one is just the regular Bob White. All right, so I have them all set up here. It's hard to see all of them. I, I just took a picture and I will put that right here so you guys can just take a look at all of them at one time. All right, so here we have the Mallard. There's the Muscovy. Bourbon Red Turkey. Americana Chicken. The New Hampshire Chicken. Here we have the store-bought chicken. There's the Oracana Americana Mix, but a double yoker. And here we have the Tulu Goose, or Tulus, I don't know how they say it. And the Chinese White Goose right there. And then we have our three quail. All right, so there they all are. It's just weird. Some of them have lighter yolks, and some have darker yolks. We got bigger, we got smaller. And I have a lot of eggs here to scramble. Okay everyone, well thanks a lot for watching, see you guys on the next video.